What's going on, YouTube? Minecraft to go here. Uh, today, I'm going to be showing you how to uh, actually use World Edit and World Guard. So, I'm on my friend server. We just started this literally like yesterday, so nothing much on it. So, alright. So, um, so, basically, to access uh, World Edit and World Guard, you're going to need a wand, which you can simply type T slash slash wand. And now we have a wand. Yay. Happy now. So, it's, uh, world edit. Oh, one second. Let me give me some. Alright, there. <clears throat> so, uh, I'm going to show you a little overview of everything. So, so now if we have two blocks like this, we click this, we click this. So now, alright, so. To get the first position, you left click. Second is right click. So now, if we just type T slash slash, two slashes, set one. So now it's like this T slash slash set four. It's like this. So we can do stuff like that. You can also do this. T slash slash set four or three. So you can do stuff like that. T slash slash set four. Yay! It's so beautiful, it's magnificent. All right. So that's basically just some of the simple commands. Now there are, there is more complex like this. We click that, and then we click this. You can do slash slash copy. Actually, no, we'll copy it from here. T slash slash copy. Because now it's going to be pasted relative to you, so we do T slash slash paste. It pasted exact replica. Ho ho! Alright, now let's say I want to um, delete all of this. You can do T slash slash set zero. Zero is error. And if you did, and I was like, oh no, I didn't mean to do that. You can do slash slash undo or ooh uh, I mean yeah I meant to do that you can do slash slash redo so there's that now we have so we'll select uh, the region again um, and now here say I want to delete everything but this one section right here we can see which way is north this way is north okay so we're gonna do slash slash contract one south which means is moved one t this way. You can also do so. This is like slash slash contract one. There's north, south, east, west, up, and down. We'll con con contract one down. And now we do slash slash set zero. It is there like this. So now I am protected from whatever might be that way or that way. If that way or that way or that way something came, we would be screwed. So yes. And again you can do slash slash undo. And now we have this again. Now here's something cool. Click this. So we now we have this region selected. Slash slash move five up. Again, north is an N, west is W, east is E, south is S, up is U, and down is D. Yep, so there it is. And so there's uh, some simple commands. So now we can, so let's say I want to build something on top of this. We select these blocks, slash slash expand, five up. So now it's made invisible selection of the area since we expanded five up. Slash slash, let me get out of here. Set one. Ta da! Yeah. So there that is. Now undo. So basically, um, what that does, uh, slash slash expand is what um what it does is it allows it like s imaginary selects a region, so you can do as instead of like having to build the block all the way up and selecting those two points, you can just expand whatever amount up or down, north, south, east, or west, and then. 
yeah, and do some of those commands. So now, let's say we want to build a ten or a five-story wall. Expand five up t slash slash walls, and then your material like a one, so you can see it. All right, so now it has a wall, but if you noticed, it changed these blocks too. So we do slash slash undo slash slash contract one up slash slash walls one and just adds on so there's that <clears throat> all right um and now I guess we'll move on to this other portion just let me delete this Alright, so there's that. So, say we want to make a tunnel, but we're too lazy to uh, to dig and all that. So we click this. So I selected these two points. Now if we do, let's see, how tall is this? One, two, three, four. So we do slash, slash, expand, four, up. Alright, now which way is north? Again, that way is north. So now we can do slash, slash, stack, ten. Since north was this way, we want to make it go that way, which is east. Stack 10 east. Ha cha cha cha! So there that is. You can also do north, south, east, or uh, north, south, west, up, or down. So now if we do stack 1 up. Yeah, yeah. Looks like a double angry face, or unhappy face, sad face. I don't know. Undo. Um, there that. There's that. Now onto the world guard portion. Say so I have a um, right. stack ten east. All right. So now <clears throat> I'll I'll select the region. Expand four up. Expand one down. So now we have the grass with it. We can do slash one slash region define happy and then whoever uh, you want to be in that region so I put mine in so now only I can edit it unless someone is an admin or an op or or, or an op sorry um yeah so now <clears throat> so yeah so now only again only I can edit it no one else if someone breaks a block like this it will just instantly reappear and not drop any items. Yeah, uh, so yeah. Now, if you say, oh no, I didn't mean to do that, you can do slash region remove. It's not even case sensitive. Happy. Uh, so this region was removed. Now we can do region list slash region list. So we'll do uh, slash region define tunnel sworn x killer. Alright, so now slash region list. Now it gives you all the regions that you have, so. Ah. Region remove tunnel. Okay, so there's that. Oh, I don't, I don't even know why I did that, because. Ah, dang it. Region define uh, define one two three, and see notice how I didn't put a name there. That means only ops can access this. So now, if let's say you want to add a member, so region info one two three, it says priority zero, flags zero or none, parent there is no parent, there's no owners, there's no members, and then it gives you the exact coordinates of where it is bound. So we can do slash region add owner one two three. So this is your zone name and then who you want. Region info one two three. Oh region info one two three. There it is. So now it says owner sworn excured. Now if I want to add a member, region add member one two three. One again one two three is the zone and then who you want region info ah. Ah. 
region info one two three there it is okay okay sorry so now members sworn next killer we can also do region add parent one two three sworn next killer uh, okay so there is no parent okay sorry about that so um, owners are basically I like you can do anything to like uh, delete owners are I believe the only ones who can like remove the region and uh, expand the region while members they can go in and like destroy blocks and or add things whatever so now region remove um, one two three and oh, okay so if you type in slash region you'll get all these like read you can redefine the region of the name um, add we save you can save the region remove we already did that you can select a region um, Remo remove member and remove owner. I forgot to mention that. Sorry. Uh, it's basically the exact opposite of add owner and add member. It make it removes them from it. Set priority. So if you want to be pretty high up on the priority list, you can do set priority ten. I don't know, whatever you want. And all right, and it was set parent. Sorry. <clears throat> so set parents, I believe, they can do anything to it. Like they're like basically. I don't know why they even have set parent, but. It's really just I just stick with owners and members, and then there's uh, load and claim. Uh, load I haven't really done much with it, so I just like leave that alone. But region uh, claim is basically the same as region define. Let's see if I do just name this little region claim one two three. So yeah, region info one aha caught myself that time one two three it, it automatically make you owner so I guess that's a, a little easier than at making yourself yeah you get what I mean region remove one two three so that is basically the basics the very very basics of world edit and world guard um, if you need a more in-depth tutorial because there is hundreds and hundreds of commands. I have just saw uh, some pa uh, paper, some pieces of paper just with all the commands on it. And this is like printed, printed, yeah it was printed and uh, there's a bunch of them. Yeah, so if you, uh, if you would like a more in-depth tutorial on this, let me know in the comments. Um, thank you for watching YouTube. Subscribe if you help. I don't care. Subscribe. Don't subscribe if it did, if it did help. Again, I seriously don't care. Um, and uh, check the the first link in the description for how to install this plugin if you have not already. Uh, thanks for watching.